In this exercise, we're going to get into editing points. We're going to rotate and move certain points to improve their position. Right now, I'm in the 09 points 3 drawing, which is located in your tutorials folder. We'll begin by locating a particular point. We're going to be looking for point 992. If we go ahead within our tool space and select points, you'll see that if we start scrolling, it looks like some of our points are out of order as you can see here. So what we can do to mitigate that is we can select this column, click it once, and now all of our point numbers are now shown in order. So let's look for point 992. Here it is, point 992. Right click on this point and then we're going to zoom to that particular point. And as you can see, if we zoom out a bit, there's a lot going on here. We'd like to improve the visibility of this point. What we'll do first is we're going to change the point style to something different. We're going to change this to a catch basin. If we go ahead and select 992, then right click and hit select, then within properties, we can change the point style from default to catch basin. And as you can see, that change has taken effect. Now what we'll do is we'll actually rotate this point. We'll do that by selecting the point itself and then hovering over this middle grip and then select Rotate Marker. And we'll rotate it so it's more or less parallel with our road. So it's in the proper position. Now you'll notice that there actually is another grip right here. If we hover over that, this is for our label. So if we move our label, we can click and drag this into this position to make things a little bit more legible. We can also use these grips in different ways. For example, if we hit this plus grip, we can move our leader like so and like so. If we want to reset it back in its original position, go ahead and click this minus and then click this once more. We also have this grip to move the leader vertex so we can move this over here like so or we can hit this minus to move it back into the original position. We can hover over this grip and we can move the label. We can also rotate the label if need be. We can also reset the label to its original position if we select reset all. So as you can see there are many different options when you're looking to edit your points within Civil 3D.